Our first scene unveils and begins Netanyahu was in focus, his voice ringing across the room. He takes a firm stand, calling for the destruction of Hamas. The air thickens with tension as he starts his impactful speech. To understand this call, we dive deep into the influence and operation of Hamas. Observing their activities reveals the thought process behind Netanyahu's words. We analyze the current situation for a comprehensive understanding. After understanding the stand, we move toward the prerequisites for peace outlined by Netanyahu. These points shape his vision of tranquility, a peace plan that he believes should be followed for a harmonious future. The first prerequisite revolves around demilitarization. Netanyahu underscores the importance of disarmament, emphasizing its pivotal role in ensuring a safer, conflict-free future for all parties involved. Moving to the second prerequisite, recognition. Moving to the second prerequisite, recognition. Netanyahu lays stress on recognition, highlighting how critical it is in moving forward. It is an essential step towards achieving mutual respect and understanding. Lastly, we have security. The third prerequisite. Netanyahu emphasizes the role security plays in maintaining peace, envisioning a future where everyone can live without fear and threats.